y'all hey boys and girls welcome back to my channel it's your girl essence of shay let's get started what the heck was that bro <laughs> like what the heck was that Top products that i think are best when you are moisturizing or hydrating your locks uh hydration of locks are super mucho importante because without hydration and moisturization your your locks will not flourish they'll break off they'll die you'll find them on your pillowcase when you wake up okay okay um don't forget to subscribe you know the deal click that button um if you're loving this head wrap <laughs> that's a reason to click that subscribe button um, anyways but I have a video right before this about how I created all my favorite uh, head wraps so number one I would say for hydration is aloe vera gel so we know aloe vera do I have any in front of me yeah so we know aloe vera gel um, very well and the pure the purest of the pure uh, this is fu fruit of the earth. I don't remember where I got this from, but um, you get a Whole Foods any hair supply store. And aloe vera gel is good because it moisturizes, it heals your scalp, and it promotes hair growth. So adding that into your regimen for like your retwist, or if you just want to like slick your hair back and you don't want to use um a edge control, that will be helping um with your locks and moisturizing the root uh because that's where most of the dryness kind of is because that's new hair emu oil uh which i have in it's one of the ingredients that i have in my um uh edge roller that i sell uh for nor brooklyn emu oil treats hair loss it gives your hair shine and moisturizes hair growth all this good stuff and those are one of the oils that i don't really consider to stink it actually smells okay because some oils are really strong getting into that will be um you guys know my 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 nose always drips getting into that would be uh jamaican black castor oil now we all know about jamaican black castor oil yes it hydrates your hair yes it helps your hair grow yes it helps your hair moisturize but the smell is a little strong so <laughs> if you can mix it up with emu oil or you can mix it up with like a lavender or like um a peppermint or something like that just to cut the smell it would do wonders for your hair uh jamaican black castor oil is one of my staples and that can that is also found in my uh yes to edges so what jamaican castor oil does it prevents uh thin hair it um makes your hair thick from where it is actually thinning it promotes a new growth and it also reduces and um it reduces hair damage so castor oil is very good uh, like I said it stinks I like I don't like the smell but it's a very good thing that you want to add to your uh, your hair regime or you want to um, put into whatever you use to moisturize your hair um, to begin with coconut oil everybody knows about coconut oil coconut oil you can <laughs> it's like a multi-purpose thing because you can um, lather your skin with it uh, you can take off your makeup you can cook with it but it's also good for hair growth and it fights infections that you have on your scalp like open cuts or any bruises or stuff like that so coconut oil is something else that i would say to add to your regime if you are allergic to it i would say just stick with jojoba or like vitamin E because some people can't their their scalp can't deal with coconut oil so yeah uh, but that would be another option like jojoba oil or almond oil or stuff like that and one other thing that I added to my regime like I want to say a couple months ago because I noticed uh, with all this stress that has been going on in my life i noticed that the back of my hair like the root part was getting a little thin for my liking um 
because the rest of my hair is really thick but the back it was getting really thin and that was due to stress and like my water intake and whatnot so I added thyme oil um or not even just thyme oil, just sprigs of thyme I would put into like my mixture. And um, what this does is it also promet, pro, promotes hair growth, but it also slowers the balding stages that may happen. Um, so that can help as well. So um, all these things together, you can mix together and it will create a bomb hydration and moisturization for your locks. But also remember that oils do not um, just simply moisturize your locks. You need a water soluble first because that is what actually hydrates the locks. It's, it's a little confusing. Because yes, all these things do work, but you need, it, it's almost like it's a sealant. And then with uh, um, rose water or um, distilled water, I would say use that to hydrate your hair, then seal it with your combination of oils, which I mentioned, and that will leave your hair fully hydrated, fully moisturized, and fully flourishing. Anyways guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If I missed anything out and if anything that I didn't say that has been helping you out, leave in the comment box below because a lot of people get some good information from the comment section below. All the information that I spoke about will be in the description box below ski. I will also leave links where you can buy all these things if you want to. No pressure. <laughs> so anyways guys, I will see you later Tiger Lily. Crash course, let me hide the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the porch? Goofy with the curb, then asking me for intercourse.